Hey, this is Andrew from AJS Woodworks, and in this video, I'm replacing both of the camshaft actuator solenoids on my 2014 Chevy Cruze. The reason I'm replacing these is because my Cruze was starting to run rough. The RPMs would jump up and down. It would almost stall, uh, and it was just running rough overall, jerking when you apply the brakes and slow down to a stop. So if your vehicle is showing those symptoms, it's worth checking out, seeing if you need to replace your camshaft actuator solenoids. I'll have the links to the exact solenoids that you need in the description below. So check those out and let's get started. These are the solenoids. There's two of them, uh, one here and one here. And they're very simple to replace. All you have to do is unplug them here and here and then remove the two bolts that hold them in and then you can pull them straight out and put the new ones in all you need is a wrench with a eight millimeter socket Now in order to unplug these, just pull this gray clip out here. And sometimes it needs some coaxing from the other side as well. And then you can slide it out. Do the same here. And then just go ahead and fully remove the bolts here. They don't take much tightening and so they don't take much loosening either. Just break them free with the wrench and you should be able to back them out by hand. Pull off these old solenoids. And they just pull straight out. Now here are the new solenoids. And these are AC Delco factory parts. I'll put the part number and link in the description so you can pick these up yourself. So we know this one goes here because of the location of the plug. So I went ahead and oiled up the gasket. That way it's not a dry gasket. And we'll slide it into place here. We'll do the same with the other one, oiling up the gasket and sliding it into place. All right, now both of the new gaskets are in and we can put the screws back in. Now we can tighten them down using our eight millimeter socket. Now we can plug them back in. And there you go, you got two brand new camshaft solenoids. So while I don't think that was the only thing wrong with my cruise, it certainly did help with the rough idling. I could tell as soon as I started it up, it was running a lot smoother. So I hope you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching.